That and more coming up. But our top story is one that is getting a lot of attention from you this afternoon, and it all hinges on this question. Will there be Bills fans in the stands for their first home playoff game? The governor made a big announcement today on that, and to On Your Side's Jackie Roberts joins us now with a look at what the proposal entails. Kate, Governor Cuomo says nothing is final yet, but the state health department is working with the Bills to iron out a plan that would allow some fans here at the stadium. Here's an idea of what that could look like. Under the proposal, 6,700 fans would be allowed to attend, with COVID-19 testing prior to the game and contact tracing after the game. Of course, the test would need to be negative to be allowed in. There would also need to be social distancing within the stadium. State officials say masks will be required at all times. There would be ushers in every section and some sections would be closed off. Health Commissioner Howard Zucker says this would be a demonstration project. He says it's a public health model that's never been done before in the country. We will work with the team to get all the fans tested who are coming in uh, beforehand uh, 6700 people prior to the game. We'll have proof of a negative result prior to entering. We'll work with the team and we will do contact tracing afterwards. And as I said, this is a demonstration project. But the health commissioner did raise concerns about spread elsewhere. For example, at parties or gatherings like this one, welcoming the team back to Buffalo at the airport after winning the AFC East. And again, the governor says this plan is in development, working with the bills to figure out the details. And we'll have much more on this coming up tonight at five and six. Back to you, Kate.